And six is getting answers about the high cost. Elise Haas shows us why the price is rising and when it could go back to normal. As I went to some of the hardest hit places by this ice storm, I was talking to residents in Clackamas County. They told me they were concerned that gas stations were gouging them, especially as they were becoming desperate for gasoline to run things like generators or even their cars to stay warm while they were without power. They asked me to see what was going on. When I looked into it, I found out that residents were indeed right that gas prices were going through the roof. And according to Gas Buddy, the national average is at its fastest pace since Hurricane Harvey. Gas prices rose more than 10 cents per gallon. Diesel jumped nearly 9 cents in the last week as well. But there is a sound reason that prices are soaring. The jump in price was the result of a dozen or so refineries, primarily in Texas, that were forced to shut down as the frigid temperatures threatened to wreak havoc on their exposed equipment. This shut down millions of barrels per day. But with the cold weather behind us, and as long as those refineries can get back online, we should start to see those price increases slow down this week or next in Oregon Elise Haas, Point 6 News.